Jeez, man. Huh. Come on. Rock on. Okay. Remember, panning out the camera, panning in can help. Okay. Bop him. Nah, just two, two health. Huh. So, I want to try something out on an enemy next time I see them. Which is right now. Okay. So, actually, I don't know if I can jump on you. Let me just see. Okay. He might so, be a little tricky to jump on this guy. Yeah. Uh, let's just... No. I... Ooh, yeah. Look, Careful. nice snacks for yum yum. Oh, oh, is that how that works? I have never realized that. That's <laughs> neat. Yeah, that is pretty cool. So I don't really get to hit you. <laughs> nah, mm -hmm. I don't think you're really a good experimental enemy. These teeth are a little jaggy. Wow, well, okay. A little jaggy. Yeah. Their their hitboxes can yeah. be surprising. Did you get make sure you got mm -hmm. everything in that? Uh, I think you did. Pretty sure I, I did. did. Better. If you're off by one note, come back here. Yeah. Cause that can that can happen. Okay, so I killed that guy with eggs. I did that. Okay. You so. Killed a clam with eggs. Oh. Feathers. Not as much, not, not as quite quite as good as I was hoping. Yeah. I think there was a feather left in there, but it's okay. Always worth it to check though. Yeah. I mean it's a 3D mm -hmm. platformer. Check everywhere. Look everywhere. Find the child. They know. Oh, frick. Ooh, oh boy. Snacker. Oh, God. So, yeah. so this is why we were surprised that you got that Jinjo so easily, because mm. of Snacker. <laughs> Snacker appears anytime you show up in the open water. I would rather have and, sneakers. And he can hit you and juggle you around. He is supposed to make getting that Jinjo a pain in the ass. You got it so fast, <laughs> he didn't even spawn in. <laughs> I was just like, oh, hey, his cool, free collectible. His music started, and that was it. I just saw it and I was like, oh, free collectible, easy. Uh, oh. And I can't fly. Follow the clues. Uh, well, uh, that's gonna be a little awkward. Yeah. This, this is, a, is flying. a flying disc, but you'll have to find my molehill before you can use it. So Cause I'm place. lonely. Please come find me. Bring fondue. <laughs> Someone mentioned it earlier. Now I'm hungry. <laughs> I kind of wanted to do fondue the other day though, but it was way too many. It was way too much food for just for Tim and me. Yeah, fondue parties are usually yeah. like what, like six people. Yeah, if I had minimum. maybe you and like one or two other people, I would have done it though. But it was just it was way too much food. I'm not super big on fondue, but I think that's mostly because most fondue parties have a lot of cheese. Oh, I, it, was, it was chocolate fondue. Uh, chocolate's weird. different. Yeah, that would work. Yeah. I was about to say you don't like anything fun. No, no, I like oh. chocolate. It's just I can't have it without breaking out. So, oh. which Ooh. sucks. You know, trust they, me, uh, it really sucks. No, I, I, I'm <laughs> agreeing with you. I'm just gonna say they told all of us that we would stop having zits after high school, and that never flipping happened. And it <laughs> bothered me so much because like, I was lied to. There was no, just like, adult, yeah, you adults get, that get it all the time if they're eating greasy stuff or well, stuff that's. It's always off. like right Ooh. before conventions. It's just have all of the acne is what my face says to me. That's why like a couple weeks before any major event, I just don't eat chocolate or try to cut down on the grease and stuff like that. The and turkey works. does all the work. Stand on a shock, jump, disc, then press and hold A. Oh, she didn't even have a comeback for that. She just took it. Boing. Mumbo, okay. Yeah. So now Mumbo. you have access to the shock pads. You do not need to stay on a shock pad for it to work. Mm -hmm. You just have to start on it. Hmm. Yeah. This is an important thing to know. That the game does not tell you, but kind of expects you to figure out. Okay. Oh, frick. <laughs> oh, yeah, that happens all the time. Sometimes. I noticed that honeycombs stay there even if you go really far away, which I wasn't expecting. Yeah, they do. Yeah, most, most items don't despawn like that, which is the nice thing about them. I think they yeah, only that's... go away if you go in like a doorway. That's technically impressive though, because, ah, frick. <laughs> okay, that's not yeah. technically impressive. Remember, Talent Trot makes you move faster. If you're struggling with some places, just use Banjo's feet. Uh, just He's block. not that lazy a bear. I gotta, mm -hmm. I gotta use bear feet. <laughs> No. <laughs> that was pretty good, actually. I, uh, uh, I'm desensitizing uh, Tim. I guess so. Now I just gotta make you live with me. <laughs> no, I'm good. Okay. Bump, 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 bump. 
I don't know, man. You know, the, the United States is a very attractive place with uh, great benefits. I'm good. Huh. I'm good. I'm not. I'm not leaving this country. I'm sorry. Uh, okay. <laughs> Not permanently, anyway. Okay, when I was trying to think of things to say about it, and I was trying to make it sound like a workplace, I was gonna say great health benefits, and I'm just like, nope. <laughs> yep, you'll win that argument against the Canadian. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I was just like, yeah, that's probably about the worst thing that I could have thought to say in that situation. <laughs> well played, sir. Well played. Ugh, I tell ya. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's give you the poots. Or not. Okay, okay, now I can yeah. try it, now I can try it. Okay, so let's try rolling into this guy. Okay. Uh, hmm. So, okay, that answers my question. I realized that every time I ground pounded somebody, it gave me two honeycombs, but I wasn't sure if that was just the crabs. But now I killed the crab by not ground pounding them, and I got one honeycomb, so ground pounding is superior. Ground pounding also does more damage, as you notice, because it took two hits to get rid of the crab versus one ground pound. Yeah, yeah. So it is just an all-around superior way if you can pull it off. It, it is also riskier, and as you saw with the uh, the clam, is a little harder to hit with. Hmm. This is a pretty good level, actually. There's a lot to it. Oh, yeah. Now, you don't know the half of it, bud. <laughs> huh, that's exciting. Well, I haven't actually gotten to fly yet. Almost halfway there and still no flight. Mm. The funny thing is, you actually passed it. Oh. That seems to happen to me a mm. lot. Oh, wow. Okay, that didn't hurt. Ooh, lucky on that one. Oh, for Oh, and there's there that teeth hitbox yeah, coming that, through. That will happen sometimes. It just does. Oof. Okay. That, however, I have not seen happen that often. It's impressive it's happened twice. Okay, I got my gum. By gum, he's done it. By Jove, he's done it. Nothing, oh. nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm, look at all these. I'll nuts. take that. Need one of those. I think I have friends who have not heard my story about why I've never played Banjo Kazooie or even that I haven't played it, and they're going to be so shocked when this comes out. Because <laughs> I'm sure a lot of people assumed that I grew up with this game like everyone else that, you know, had Nintendo. Did. I feel at the same time though they're gonna be like, oh yeah, that's that sounds like an Emil story. That sounds like something <laughs> that happened to him. Well, gee, thanks. I I know you have confidence in me. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me my, I'm wrong. My child self was pretty stupid. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> okay, the stupid infants. Okay, the stupid <laughs> infants. Nice. <laughs> We've talked about yes, watching. Beat me to it. We've talked about having a Ninja Turtles movie marathon one of these days. I yeah. love Turtles too. It's a great movie. Mm -hmm. Hey! Mm. I finally got one of these. It's been a while. On the that, that was my on first world. one. Wow. Yeah. Yep. I've gotten half the collectibles, but that was my only jiggy. I told oh. you the world's big. Yeah, they mm. make you Here work comes for a brand new world. A whole new world with jiggies galore. You know, if I could actually ask the Banjo Kazooie developers one thing, it, it I, this is kind of a weird thing to ask them now that I'm actually going to say it. Um, oh, in God. Nuts and Bolts, there is a design decision that I've never been able to understand ever, and that's the Jiggy Dispensers. That you don't just get the Jiggy for beating a mission, instead you get a token to stick in a vending machine to carry the Jiggy to the tank where it is stored. I don't get why they did that. It just, it feels so like such a needless extra step. It's because later on, like, they start putting enemies in there to mess with you and try to, like, make it a challenge. I don't know. I, I think that I if agree. I got the jig... I agree. You should just get the damn credit for it. Yeah, but, I, I should mean, just they, get the jig if I got They had a design reason for it. Oh, hi. Ah, wow, very intuitive. Yeah, I feel like I should just get the jiggy if I, you know, got the jiggy. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. So this is a little tricky, it looks like. Nice jump. Uh, Thank you. Had to well. do it late. Got nine lives. Yeah, that's the max amount of lives. That's, yep, sure enough is. Ouch. <laughs> I thought that would Ow. save me like in Mario 64. Uh, as you just realized, there is fall damage. <laughs> yeah. I have heard a complaint. I heard fall damage being really unforgiving as a complaint here, so I've been trying to be careful with that. Like, that is a complaint it, I've heard about this game from be. other people. There are ways around it. There's actually a cheating or like a trick you can use to not take any fall damage. It's kind of cool. Huh. Yeah, that's pretty cool. 
not ground pounding. Well, that's you know what, never mind. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, go, go, go. Okay. Uh. Mason jars. Yo. This is your big chance, chicken legs. It's time for you to fly. At last, it better be easy, bog eyes. <laughs> Simple enough even for you, bird brain. Just stand on a flying disc and press A. Here's 25 red feathers to help you. I'm already maxed out, you ass. No. Mm, yeah, just a little low. I'll fill it up for you. Nice going. You've learned all the cove's new moves. Wow. Okay. Now we can just explore to our heart's content. Uh, there was a guy down here though. Yep. But yeah, the salty, the salty hippo. <laughs> the yep. salty hippo. Because he's crying. Aww, I was gonna make fun of him, but he's crying. Ahoy there, I'm Captain Blubber, and I've lost me treasure when me ship crashed. Well, go find it then, Blubber Guts. <laughs> oh, oh. But I can't swim. Can you help an old sea hippo? Yeah, sure, we'll find it for you. It's gotta be around here somewhere. We. Oui. <laughs> Can he solve the mystery? Everything's always mysteries Indeed. with you, and I like that. <laughs> Seek a way out. Mysteries are cool. Or in this case, in. You hmm. broke me, ship! Making his life well even worse. Done. Uh, no sharkies in here? I guess not. <laughs> That'd be kind of mean. Gold. Just straight Lots up gold. gold. Yeah, I mean, he is a pirate. Hmm. Power of gold. Hmm. Do, 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 yeah, do, unfortunately, do, do, you can't move the camera at all in this room, so it does cause problems. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's also small enough room, so that it's at least easy yeah, practice. There you go, for you it. Yeah, I love gold. Wow, that is terrifying what their voices sound like. Yeah, well, I mean, it's just pounded yeah. metal. Hmm. Ooh. So I'm guessing there's Ooh. another entrance on the other side then. Maybe? And that would make I sense. I ain't saying nothing. <laughs> right back here! I was holding up! Come on! That should be like a rule. Oh, there's one. Aye, that'd be half of me gold. I'm still sad though. Oh, there's a hole I'm over here. I'm only half a millionaire. Nice. You found it. Being half a millionaire is the most horrifying thing I could think of next to being 30 years old. Ugh. Yeah, who wants that? Uh, we're both gonna slap you, by the way. I'm 30 years old too. I can talk of yeah. smack about it if I want. <laughs> Yeah, but we're both older than you, so yeah. Oh. Well, um... I mean, are you sure Ooh. you can handle that at your age? Tim, you wanna just punch him in the nuts for me? <laughs> <laughs> well, I could do even better than that. I could, uh... Hmm, let me think. Uh-oh. Uh. -oh. uh. <sighs> What's the worst punishment you can think of? Well, uh... Maybe being incinerated. <laughs> wow. Okay, I didn't want to go that far. Wow. I mean, I'm I wanted him to still live. Here, so. <laughs> that's Shit. the nicest uh, thing you've ever said about me, John. Sad that that's the bar we've set for our friendship. Uh, I mean, it's it's a new record. There have been a couple other times in the channel's history I've said that, and we've made progress from that. <laughs> mm. I wonder legitimately how many times I have said that's the nicest thing you've ever said to me, John. Because I know I've said that to you at least once in the past. I, that's probably like the third or fourth time at least. Okay. It I'm has been a just spend, mm -hmm. spend, spend. What? Yeah, right. You should put he it in an NFT. That'd be. Whoa! I am so sorry about that. To be fair, Bruh. he actually does show up in the second game, and he spent all of his gold. Mm. So. That's right. On nothing. Uh, alcohol, I believe. Oh. That was a lot yeah, of he like games. opens a store or something. It's oh, like is that, that what it is? Okay, because I remember meeting him in the bar. I might just be confusing it with something else. It might be that he works at the bar. I don't know. <laughs> I can no. remember if he oh. works the bar, owns the bar, or if he's just drunk at the bar. 
Or I'm, or I'm confusing it with the actual pirate that's there that's drunk at the bar. Man, kids' oh, games yeah. were intense back then. But then again, I played yeah. Earthbound Rare as a kid, so. got away with a lot that they shouldn't have. Yeah. I am amazed I Nintendo did not give them any crap. I guess I played Earthbound, so I should- Oh, you can just climb it, okay. I was wondering when you were gonna try that. You can just walk over it. Cowabunga. Cowafuckness! Cowafuckin' Cowafuck piece of dog shit. Yeah, Tim <laughs> This game is diarrhea coming out of my dick. Oh, okay, I'm Yeah, I Sorry, Dan. Um... <laughs> You're probably gonna have to go. That, that was always my favorite AVG episode when I was like 15. I mean, that's like, yeah. what, the second episode? What, yeah, like no, four or like five. Or fourth. Yeah, like it's, it's a little bit in though, but I remember that was always the one that I went back to to rewatch again and again. Even as somebody yeah. who likes that game. Turtles 1? Yeah, yeah it's I, me. I Turtle 1. <laughs> yeah, you, you and I love Turtles 1. We've played it when you visited before. Yeah, it's, oh, yeah, it was a game I grew up with, and while it's weird as heck, like it's an alright game. Yeah. There's definitely much better Turtles games, but mm -hmm. it's all right. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. Like, it provides a different experience, so, like, there are reasons to go back to it, even with the arcade games existing.